Rise of Skywalker. Nah. Hey guys, welcome back to the Cantina. This is Stephanie, your friendly neighborhood bartender. Uh, please feel free to subscribe if you haven't. Please hit the bell for more content. So when you, I upload, you know I uploaded. Uh, please hit the like button, smash that like button. And uh, share away here. We share away here if you love Star Wars. This is uh, about the, the teaser trailer that came out. And a little bit, a little bit about the panel, which was excruciating. Um, it, uh, and... Uh, some thoughts I have on all of it. So. Hey guys, it's Steph. Welcome back to the Cantina. So, Star Wars Celebration uh, finally really got its kickoff with uh, the Episode Nine panel. Uh, and it was fine till the new cast came out. And then uh, it made me want to gag. And then finally, I mean, first off, if you could watch the whole panel and not think that J.J. Abrams and Kathleen Kennedy hate each other's guts. You can actually go away thinking they're friendly to each other. You're full of shit. Half the time, JJ looked at her like, why are you here? Why are you here? Why? I'm trying to look at both of them going, why are they they're there? But there you go. Anyway, let's talk a little bit about what we saw in the trailer. Because enough of the, tra the panel, because it was excruciating and stupid. First off, the voiceover you hear is Mark Hamill. The laugh at the end is Ian McDermott as Palpatine. So yes, he's definitely in it. I found the... I found the music that they chose, it's Leia's theme, uh, it's, it's Princess Leia's theme, to be intriguing. Leia hugging Rey uh, is very intriguing to me. Uh, you know, and the one thing that was intriguing about the panel is when Stephen Colbert, who's a, a, a fucking moron, asked Daisy about Kyle Ron, she basically kind of shot it down. So I, I didn't get anything like that from the trailer. I also didn't get anything, anything really from the trailer, except I'm going to say this. At the very end of uh, the trailer where you see them all, they're, they're all standing around. And see that thing in the distance there on Endor. And that's a piece of the Death Star. Okay. So uh, we got Endor. We've got uh, Tatooine. They're not on Jakku. They're on Tatooine. And uh, we've got other things going on. Um, didn't really show how uh, this sort of band of, of Motley Crue band of, of people got together. Because I know that. Leia sends all of them on recruiting missions, and Lando and the Falcon was, was pretty cool, even though I don't want him to have the Falcon. Okay, I really, really don't. I don't. Um, but I think they just threw that out to bring the old audience in, and they might have done the Leia hugging Rey uh, for uh, the audience's sake to bring us back. We'll have to see. Now, you have Luke saying stuff like uh, a thousand generations live inside of you. I don't understand what that means. Now, he might be saying, you know, you're the granddaughter of Anakin Skywalker. A thousand generations live in you. Or he might be saying, guess what? You're a clone. And she better not fucking be a clone. Okay. I didn't, I got that from that. But then I, when you hear the music, Leia's theme and see her hugging Ray, and then uh, he, Luke says in the end, no one's ever truly gone. We will be with you always. Uh, it kind of made me think of, we, we're going to get some good old fashioned flashbacks and we might get a chance to see Han Solo again. Uh, maybe dropping off his worthless piece of shit son. Um, don't they have abortion in the galaxy? Didn't someone say, hey, you know, that kid's pretty bad. He's not going to grow up to be worth anything. He might, you know, did I get any redemption for Kyle Ron? I didn't see anything. I didn't. This is a very short 30 second, you know, I'll have to watch it again. It's just very intriguing to me. Uh, 
you know, I'm going to wait again till we get more spoilers. But I got to say this. If they do anything but care solo in this, they are fucking morons. But I will say this. There's no Raylo, and you can tell. Okay? There's no Raylo. Who is Leia hugging? Ray. Okay? No, maybe Kyle Ron. I don't know. I... Or maybe he just gets pissed off because he's not chosen or something like that. And the Emperor decides to kill him. And Ray's like, okay. <laughs> I don't know. So anyway, guys, I hope you get to see it. I will leave a link to one of the uh, sites that will have it. I'm not going to leave a link to uh, the uh, the Star Wars channel here because I, I hate them. And uh, I don't want to give uh, that little bitch, uh, Andy... Gutierrez, any kudos, because uh, she, she should be fired, all right? Training fans like shit, and she's still there. She needs to go. Anyway, this is Steph signing off. I'll see you around the galaxy, see you around the cantina. Please remember to uh, tip the Wookiee bartenders 20%. And, uh, you know, don't start any fights in the cantina, because if you do, there will be a mess. I got to pay for it. No gunfights in the cantina. Take it outside. No droids, no bunny hunters. I'll see you around the galaxy and I'll see you around scoundrels. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Hit that bell so you know when I upload more content. Hit that like button. And please feel free to share. We share away with a lot of Star Wars. Uh, you know, the trailer was interesting. I'm not going to say it was good. Uh, but, you know, uh, you, if you've seen it, leave a comment in the comment section. And let's talk about it. So, I'll see you around scoundrels.